Scott Jameson Getty images in a game full of numbers, one number has evaded players on the European tour for decades. That number is 59. While 18 rounds of 59 have been carded in official professional events around the world, and even two ridiculous totals of 58 from Jim Furyk and Stefan Jaeger, no one has yet posted the coveted score in a European tour event. 18 players have shot 60 on the European tour in official rounds, with Darren Clark the only man to do so twice. However, this week's Portugal Masters presents players with a golden opportunity to shoot the magic number. Since the first year of the event back in 2007, there have been 13 rounds of 62 or less at the Dom Pedro Victoria Golf Course in Vila Mauro. Indeed, seven of those have been 61 or lower, more than in at any other course on the European Tour in the last 10 years, while in 2016 the course averaged 2.24, the lowest of any course in the 2016 season. Two men have, however, come the closest to that maiden, Ilyas of 59. In 2013, Scott Jameson arrived in Portugal on the back of a win earlier in the season at the weather-affected Nelson Mandela Championship. At that event, the Scott fired a second round 57, but the course was shortened to a par 65 due to heavy rain during the week and so was struck from official records. However, after opening with rounds of 66 and 73 at the Portugal Masters, Jameson made a charge for a 59 on Saturday. After carting a 29 on the front nine, he holed an 8-foot putt on the par 3 13th hole to reach 9 under. Two more birdies at the 16th and 17th holes meant a birdie on the 18th would put the 29-year-old in the history books. Having found the fairway, Jameson's approach shot trickled in the fringe beyond the pin, leaving him a chip shot of around 10 yards for a 59. With three feet to go the ball looked destined for the hole but it slipped past the right edge leaving Jameson on his knees and a score of 60 on his card. Jameson required just 20 pots that day. It did not take long for fans at the Portugal Masters to see another run at history. Just 12 months later, Nicholas Colserts came to Villa Maura having finished tied fourth at the Wales Open two weeks before. During the opening round, the Belgian got off to a good, if not spectacular start. He was three under par when he made his way down the ninth fairway and made birdie there for a front 931. Birdies at the 10th, 11th and 12th holes made things interesting, and having made par on the 13th and 14th, Colserts eagled the short par 4 15th. After following that up with another eagle on the 589-yard 17th hole, the goal was clear of birdie 3 on the last for 59. The 32-year-old found the right side of the fairway and then found the right side of the green, leaving 18 feet for history. He struck the putt well, only to watch it trickle agonizingly close to the left edge of the hole. Whilst preferred lies were enforced that day, Colsert's round would still have been the first 59 carded on the European tour. Alas, we're back three years later on and still waiting for our first Mr. 59. Might it yet come this week don't bet against it, this might just be the perfect place for the job.